it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel so today we are going to learn about how to write certain data into a text file with the help of C language so how we can do that first of all you need to open a folder any folder on the desktop or any other okay okay here you can see that we are in a folder named as triple RR RR R okay so this is our folder so you can open any folder and right click on it go to new and then you can click on text document now uh, we can write the name that is first okay now we will double click on it okay now this is our notepad simple notepad so we will write all our code here so first we will write hash include stdio.h stdio.h is a header file which contains a lot of functions and procedures inside it and it, it simply means standard IO input and output .h uh, if, if you are not familiar with the header files it is just like a simple physical library in which you can put certain books so that you can use them okay so there are certain functions inside this library to be used within the program and the next library is our console io.h or conio.h so it is conio.h so it is also uh, used for in order to take input and to show output the third one is our string hash include string.h string means that if there are certain characters in a respective manner and if they are the collective characters then we can say these are the strings so it deals with the strings okay uh, I will explain it within the program so no need to uh, confuse so okay now now there is a main function wide man okay now we will write wide man okay now void main is our main function okay you, you should have to create it why it is so because it is the main syntax of our program void main and why uh, main is the name of our function and why we have written void because it is not taking any sort of uh, return type like uh, because all the things will be executed inside this body okay Okay, whenever when when the control will enter this function within the body of this function all these statements will get executed and after all these statements get executed nothing is going back again to this void man okay so that is why we have written void we can write if we can write end character as well if if you want to return something to this main function okay so now void man so so after wide main uh, oh, you, you should have to create or declare certain variables character like uh, we can write chr is equal to this thing okay now what is this chr is a variable and we will write 10 and it will show that 10 is the length of this character and chr is just a variable you can write anything here if you want to write str a b c or a b c or anything it is okay it is just a memory location memory location uh, with the name chr and you can store certain data in it and what sort of data you can store in it it is character of character data type that is chr now and now uh, what we want to store in this let us suppose that we, we, we can write good okay now this good it is inside these uh, quotation uh, inside these commas quotations so good is a uh, obviously uh, like uh, a combination of characters because G is a character O is a character and all D and all these things are characters so now it good all all this is stored inside this CHR variable okay and next thing is FILE PTR now what is this okay this is our pointer pointer is a thing okay 
you can write any other word if you want to write ere -E, still it is okay okay now ere -E, still it is okay why have we, we have written this star here because we want to declare this ere -E variable as a pointer it will what it will do it will store the memory address of, of what is called as the uh, memory address of a location of file data type okay okay so it, it will store the address okay it will store the address of of what type of data of file data type okay so now we will go and we will write ere -E is equal to f open okay because now now, now you can you can see this ere -E is equal to f open equal to f open so why this f open function will do two things okay first it will go for to create a file F file is like uh, we can say it is triple e triple e dot txt okay it will create a text file and then we can write data okay w mean write data in the text file and f open means it will create and open and then write something in it okay and uh, this f open function will give us the memory address okay in ere we got the memory address of this f open that is file this text file now we we have a built-in function that is called as f printf f printf means that write something in this file which file whose address is stored inside this ere okay and uh, obviously we need something to store inside this file whose address is at ere and that word is chr that is character and it contains good in it so this is a very simple thing okay now we will save it as like first dot c okay first dot c and you also need to click on all files and it will change it to dot c file you can you can delete this first as well okay if you want okay now okay now okay again okay. and one more thing that before going towards this step cmd you need to go on google and install or download the borland c++ compiler it is a very simple thing if you will not do that it is not going to work okay so first install borland c++ compiler and then come here so we will write bcc32 and the name of this file that is first.c first.c and okay now it is it 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 it, it created the uh, what's called as the x okay now now we will write first first just okay first and now okay now it has it, it created the triple e uh, text file and what is it written inside this good okay so in this way you can write any sort of data into the text file with the help of ch so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe